Well, Alex, Marla, people who are sleeping in their cars will tell you finding a location to spend the night can be difficult. Now, Long Beach City College is offering this parking lot for all of those students who don't have a place to call home. Implementing this now is like so awesome. Students experiencing homelessness are expressing their gratitude for this new safe parking pilot program at Long Beach City College. Because living out on the streets is really not safe. LBCC is currently allowing unhoused students to park their cars overnight in this well-lit parking lot. They have Wi-Fi, outlets to charge their laptops, and restrooms with showers. Plus, we secure the parking structure for them so they don't have to worry about anyone walking up from the street and kind of um, bothering them. They'll be safe and secure. Dr. Mike Munoz is the interim superintendent president at Long Beach City College. He says when administrators discovered 69 students were sleeping in their cars, the school felt it had a responsibility to help. I'm not saying that a safe parking program is going to solve all their problems. We know that this is a very serious issue, but it's a first step in providing them a safe space while they park, why we connect them with transitional housing support. Support is desperately needed. The college recently conducted a survey. 3,000 students reported they are struggling to pay the rent. Another 1,000 said they are housing insecure and on the brink of homelessness. You know, the cost of living has really increased in California over the last several years. We also know that, you know, our students have been struggling with basic needs for quite some time, and the pandemic has only made the challenges worse. I'm the first in my family yeah. to actually go to college. Patricia Lopez didn't want anyone to know she was homeless and sleeping in her car with her daughter. But hiding it wasn't easy. It's very um, depressing. It's very just just stressful, not knowing where you're going to go, how where are you going to sleep, or how are you even going to get to classes, how are you going to be able to, like, you know, be able to uh, pass classes. LBCC connected Patricia to an agency that helped her find transitional housing. She and her daughter now have a place to call home. It feels really comforting to have a new home instead of just living at the streets. Their advice to any students experiencing homelessness? It's not the end of the road. There, there is help. Don't, don't feel ashamed or anything like that. I know it's a hard thing to do, but you will, it will be very rewarding <laughs> once you do reach out. It's, it will be very rewarding. Don't give up. Yeah, don't give up. Never give up. The safe parking program is available to students from 10 p.m. until 7 a.m. Reporting from Long Beach, I'm Gina Silva. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. What a story. What a program. A reminder that the faces of homeless are very diverse, Gina, as well.